Okay. Sky, you may speak. Um, maybe I messed up and didn't use the dialogue options for those two people. I should have. So we'll try again. But this time we'll do with. Die, Fetcher! Now the other guy's name disappears? Oh, man. Wait. You may speak. Wait, Under I sun and sky, Outland. Yes, Outland. We greet you. Your daddy, what does he do? Oh. I killed your leader. I decided to answer. I'm no leader now. The names disappear when they die. <laughs> what the fuck, game? So this isn't helping my situation at all. <laughs> I like making the uh, the interface nice and personal where it completely blocks out their face. Like, I don't care. What do you start? Oh. It's just like their head peeking over the top. A little puppet. Mmm. Sarah. Look at me with your eyes.
Uh, this is this is confusing, right? Like, am I even supposed to be killing these guys? What is this about? Well, if I talk to you, you're gonna want to kill me. Apparently, that's what it's about. Then your girls will be dead, and the monsters will come and they eat all your faces. You may speak. Oh look! Now he wants to kill me. Imagine that. Die. <laughs> Right, two clip. Oh, 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 party's over. Hey, what was that? Flame arrow. My goodness. What is this about? Talking Morrowind? No. Why did Skyrim make the elven species so ugly? Yeah, so nice what it like, actually. Because like, this mod, the overhaul, is really good. Oblivion has got some funky looking characters. I don't know what happened with that one. I kill everybody. I killed everybody. Everybody's dead. Dead, 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 dead. If I feel it like it was completely worthless coming out here. Muth Sarah? That's what I feel like. Nope. What is this about? I don't know. You got anything cool to tell me? What should I slaughter the whole camp? Muth Sarah? Blah, blah, blah. Let's do some business, shall we? Oh, sure, buddy. Oh, oh yeah. You got some nice trinkets. Trade you your entire camp for this string of beads. Is that our trust, Ace? I don't trust you enough. Wait, I have the needle? I have to give you some money. Do I have to throw a little bit of change your way? Is that what you're telling me? A little, little, uh, little persuasion? About 75. Yeah. Yeah, it's suitable. Oh, hey! Uli Bobby, now what's what I'm talking about right here? See, she likes me. All it took was a little bit of a greasing of the old palm. Just a moment, you mentioned the needle? In the valley of the wind? I recall the top of... At the top of that tall spire is not white, but much lighter than other rocks nearby. The head of the valley of the wind sits right under the needle. It is a good, safe campground, sheltered from wind. With only one approach, that whitish rock at the top of the needle. That might be the pearl you're looking for. Waka waka bang bam! Teeth of the Wind. Hmm, I know no place of that name, but there is a place called Aaron's Teeth. <laughs> In the Valley of the Wind, these two rock spires mark the entrance to the Valley of the Wind. They bear the name of the seer, Aaron, who's one blessed to Azura. Well, shit. Are you even... Who are you? You're not even in the... Are you in the wrong tent? You know what? Let's do this. Talking Morrowind does two things. One, makes all... Makes... Makes at the menus, dialogue windows, etc. Real time with no pause, sort of like Skyrim. Allows you to have NPC dialogue read to you via voice software. <laughs> so with really good software, you can get some decent, all-encompassing voice acting. <laughs> Hello, welcome to the thing. Hello, Outlander. You are not welcome here. Yeah. Let's do some business, shall we? Hello, Outlander. Tell me about the skin of the pearl. Is that a place? I am not familiar. A pearl skin is white and round. Perhaps that is what you should look for. Teeth of the wind. It's a matter of trust, Ace. And I don't trust you enough yet. I'm afraid what you ask is impossible. Wait, what? B6? What happened to the- What? Did I give her a hunter on accident before? I admire you. Girl, you so sexy. This is suitable, Ace. That's the decent software. <laughs> Teeth. Skin. Red Mountain. Red Guard. Peak Orc. Orc. 
Oh, whoops. Uh, hoop, boop, beep, bop, boop, beep, beep, boop. All right. Now, did you put it on my map? Uh, oh, ghost gate. The knob camp. It looks new, doesn't it? Bing, 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 bing. Okay, Greetings, know. Outlander. Don't I know you from somewhere? Uh, yeah. I could kill that guar. Those boots are ruined. Those boots are ruined. Now the other wind. There are two valleys side by side on the northeast slopes of Red North Northeast slopes of Red Mountain. The westmost valley is called Dry Camp Valley. The camps have no water, but they are sheltered from the wind. The Anang Caverns are also there. The Valley of the Wind is the east eastmost valley. It runs along runs long and straight south between Aaron's Teeth and climbs towards Red Mountain. Both mouths of these valleys are to the east along the coast, past Buthand, Dweaver Ruined, and just past Bonapal in Danger Group. Did you update my map? Please update the map. Northeast of the map. No, you didn't. Oh, did you? No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Northeast. So what, over here? Is that it right there? That might be it right there. Ooh. Next to Zainab. Did you mention Zainab? I don't think you did. I could kill that guar. Those boots, boots are ruined. ruined. Shut up. Just past Zergo Nepal. Wait, that's, that's that was placed on the map, wasn't it? Zergo Nepal. Runs long and straight south between those two. The mouths of these valleys are to the east along the coast. The coast, past the Thuan. The Thuan just past the Dejo. Should run there. <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, great. So it's back to Telmora. Or. Yes. Maybe even future software. Um, well. I guess we're. Under sun and sky, Outlander. We. Ruth Sarah? You may speak. You're an imposter, aren't you? You're an imposter pasta. Oh, tell Mora. out in the wise woman's yurt. Be good like that, I'm saying. Crashing until he
Oh, I must be getting tired. Why did I?